Aloha everyone, Jody Mountain here with Lineage of Light and more with the Ancient Wisdom series. So today I'd like to offer you an idea that is probably found in many, many different spiritual traditions. And certainly you've heard it before, but I'd like to maybe offer some new tools to find ourselves in this more expansive place. So that, that idea that I'd like to offer you is the idea of finding ourselves in the present moment as much as possible, allowing all of our presence to land in this moment. So in our modern world, we can spend a lot of time in the past or in the future, you know, worrying either way, having anxiety either way, uh, imagining what we should do or um, worrying about what we did or what was done to us in the past. And while there may be a time and a place for certain reflections that we need to do, um, most of our lives, the benefit is to be found, tremendous benefit is to be found being right here, right now. Because this is the only place that we actually are that we actually exist is right now. And this is the only moment that we can act. This is the only moment we can meet and come in relationship, come into a relationship with whatever is arising inside of us, whatever is coming to us seemingly from the outside. Um, the present moment is really all we have. And everything else is either just imagination, projection, or memory. So in a, in a sense, it's like leaking energy, leaking energy in a place that um, can't really, can't embrace that energy, can't use that energy. And instead taking all of our energy and allowing it to land in the moment that can actually help us move forward in life. Taking all of that energy and allowing ourselves to inhabit it and to be inhabited by it. That is what, that's one of the things that brings us power in the present moment, the power to be present and the power to act, the power to, to be clear. Um, a lot of things can happen in this moment that can't happen in the past and that can't happen in the future or our imagined idea of the past or the future. So how do we do that? How do we stay as much as possible in the present moment? I would say the first thing is to recognize uh, when we are drifting or unnecessarily, let's say, drifting into the future or drifting into the past, when we have abandoned ourselves in this moment is a good practice to to pay attention to, to notice what am I actually doing right now? Oh, I was just in a, a whole scenario that isn't happening right now and doesn't really help me to go through these numerous scenarios because actually in most cases, we just have to wait until we arrive at that meeting with that person or that circumstance and we will see if we're, we're open to the living moment we will see how how we meet that and to decide ahead of time we might be deciding upon um, a scenario that really isn't isn't true so the idea in ancient wisdom is to stay in the living moment the only place where life is actually alive is right now so first to notice what we're doing and the second thing to do that's fairly easy, actually, is to come back to the body. Is to allow ourselves to just feel what's really true right now, here and now in the body. Because the body is always here now. The body is never in the past or in the future. It's always simply meeting what is. What is in the cellular function, what is in the organs, in relationship to everything else that is in the body. All the nerves, all the cells, all the blood, all the organs, uh, all the um, 
all the hormones, all the glands, everything is, has to be right here, right now, um, meeting what's true and doing the best it can. Um, which is usually amazing unless we kind of grab onto something with our tension, emotional tension, physical tension, and then things can, uh, the body's still doing the best it can, but it, it has to struggle around our tension. Anyway, that's a different conversation. <laughs> um, so imagine, notice what you're doing in the moment if you want to try this. And then if you do find that you'd like another tool to come back to the present moment, just drop into your breath. Just drop into the feelings and the bottoms of your feet. Just drop into any sensations that are arising in this moment. And notice, if you do, how that brings you more here now. Um, and then maybe other, other levels, let's say, of what is here now might also start to expand and to speak. Okay, that's it for today. Thanks for joining. I look forward to seeing you again. Aloha.